Understanding Overwhelmed by Debt Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our channel, where we simplify English phrases for you. Today, we're diving into a very common expression that you might have heard, overwhelmed by debt. This phrase is not only vital in understanding personal finance discussions but also enriches your English comprehension. So, let's break it down together. First, let's look at the word, overwhelmed. It's a feeling many of us are familiar with, even if we haven't realized it. To be overwhelmed is to be engulfed by emotions or situations so much that it becomes difficult to cope or deal with them. It's like standing in a wave that's too strong for you, and it sweeps you off your feet. Imagine being buried under a mountain of pillows. You're safe, but you can't easily find your way out. That's the essence of feeling overwhelmed, but in this context, it's not pillows we're dealing with, it's debt. Now, on to debt. Debt is money or something of value that one person, organization, or country owes to another. It can come from loans, credit cards, or any situation where you borrow now and agree to pay back later. Debt isn't inherently bad. It can be a tool for building a future, like loans for education or a home. However, when debt becomes more than one can manage, it leads to problems. When we say someone is overwhelmed by debt, we mean they have so much debt that it becomes a significant burden, making it difficult for them to manage their daily lives or see a clear way out. This phrase paints a picture of someone struggling under the weight of their financial obligations, much like being caught in that strong wave or buried under those metaphorical pillows, except the consequences here are more severe and very real. This situation can affect anyone, regardless of their background or income, and can lead to severe stress, anxiety, and even depression. It's not just about numbers. It's about the impact on one's mental health and overall well-being. To make it clearer, let's consider a few examples. John took out loans to pay for his education, but after graduating, he found it hard to get a job that pays enough to cover his monthly loan payments. Now, John feels overwhelmed by debt. Maria used her credit cards to cover medical bills for an unexpected illness. As the bills piled up, so did her debt, leaving Maria overwhelmed and unsure of what to do next. These scenarios show how easily one can find themselves overwhelmed by debt, highlighting the importance of managing finances wisely and seeking help when needed. Understanding phrases like, overwhelmed by debt, goes beyond just learning English. It's about grasping the real-life situations many people face. We hope this video has not only helped you understand the phrase but also the serious implications it can have on someone's life. Remember, if you or someone you know is feeling overwhelmed by debt, it's important to seek advice and support. Thanks for watching, and we look forward to bringing you more helpful content soon.